everybody and welcome back to the channel. It is your friendly neighborhood fisherman, Raznak. We are back in the world of fishing Barrent Sea. We're going to do something different today. Last episode we did some crab fishing. Today we're going to do some net fishing. This is something I haven't done yet, some net fishing. So I went ahead and uh, I had like 1.2 million and I went ahead and spent a bunch of money. I went ahead and bought eight big nets. Uh, so eight long nets, 165 meter nets. I went ahead and bought those. We can hold up to eight. Um, what else did I buy? Oh, I went ahead and I've upgraded the boat. Uh, let's see. I have the max storage upgrade, so we hold tons of fish. I have the max engine upgrade, so we got tons of horsepower. Uh, everything's been fully upgraded. The only thing I haven't upgraded yet are the quotas because I'm not anywhere even near close to the quota and I went ahead and bought the net hauler. And if you remember in the last episode, uh, depending on what you equip, this is the long line hauler right here. This is the pot hauler that we've been using. So we're set up for pots, right? Uh, and then this is the net hauler, which is a, a, a net table. So that's what we're going to use now. So we're going to go ahead and uh, go ahead and do that. We're currently in Abel Fisher. Our reputation in Hammerfest is with Abel Fisher. There's jobs and stuff. I haven't done any of them. I've just been fishing. I've just been fishing. So let's get fishing. Let's go fishing. We have our nets. Oh, also, pick up the phone here. I have a crewman right here. Because you need a crewman to run your net. In order to net, you have to have at least two people. Um, so that's him. That's Ein R. Haraldson. He's a really good engineer. He's good at repairing. He's good at uh, some other stuff. Net hauling's okay. I actually had him cook up some food for us. He's been sitting in here cooking. They do have a limited amount of stamina, so they only can do stuff for so long before they have to rest. Some people are stronger than others. Let's get away from the dock, man. I really wish they would Just kind of had to back away. So you don't damage your boat. How are we doing? Oh, yeah. I filled up the fuel. I really think this might be a coding error. This 10,000 liters of fuel. It's something, something weird there. I think they may have put a decimal point in the wrong spot. Because this thing is never... We'll run out of fuel but now that we have the max hp you look watch we'll crank this thing up look fuel just starts dropping baby oh no Woo. <laughs> look at it just sucking the gas sucking that diesel out of there all right we'll stop moving for now where do we want to go uh i think haddock and pollock Redfish, ooh, this is all, kind of all species, eh, all species, so redfish, Edic, Pollock, probably this run right here, but this is closer, so let's just go ahead and go here, let's say, start right here, and we'll kind of run this way and drop our net, I, I don't, I have no idea what I'm doing, I'm pretty sure there's like a little mini game, I think this one, if I remember watching right, I did watch one video where you have to kind of keep the net in the right spot. Um, or you can damage your nets. There's no bait involved. There's none of that stuff that you have to get. So it's really about being gentle. Gentle with your nets. That's what we're going to be here. All right. Let's pull up our sonar. Oh, I, I really haven't even looked at the sonar. I usually just go off what the map tells me. Oh, easy. You have to be careful with this boat. You really got to feather it. You can oversteer real easy. You can over accelerate real easy. But I mean, we're, we're banging out huge amounts of horsepower. Let's kind of get a little bit more here in the orange. All right. Let's throttle back to just kind of minimum and set our gear like i said there's a mini game here yeah you got you're supposed to keep the the blue in the middle 
and it's if it's in rough seas it's of course it's going to be harder but and then of course the faster you go the harder it is so i just kind of set it at five knots just a nice slow steady pace as our net come is just rolling out because you don't want to damage your net at least I th I'm, that's what I'm assuming. I'm assuming you don't want to damage your net. Oh, slow down. Okay. Just getting a little bouncy. Are you just pressing left and right or A and D? Just to kind of. It starts going one way, you press the other way. Pretty simple. I mean, it's not too hard. It is. It, you hear the lightning? There's a storm moving in. Um, hoping the seas don't get rough. Alright, so that net is dropped. And just like everything else in the game, I think it's like 18 to 20 hours is what you want to leave your net. Um, I really don't know how many fish we'll bring in. So we're going to we're gonna drop another one right here. Just kind of speed away just a little. 166 meter net. I hope nobody drives through our net. And then I think we're going to drop these two here. And then I think I'm going to skip time because I, I, I don't want to have four nets in the water, but you know, when I bring all the fish in, I don't have room for all of it because then it's just kind of wasteful. Right? Set at five knots. Set our net. All right, I'm going to get this done, and we're going to head into port and rest. And then I'll be back in just a moment, and we'll do some fishing. We'll bring in the nets and see how well we do. I'll see you then. All righty. Uh, the, what have we been sitting at? 19 hours and 7 minutes. We've been sitting a pretty good amount of time. First things first, I need to grab my crewman, who's well-rested, and I need to put him over here in the the net hall and then if you if we uh, if we escape out we can be there's our little guy he's coming over here to his station he's getting ready we're gonna bring in some nets that's what we're about to do and I'm gonna help him but first what we need to do is let's pull alongside our uh, our little our buoy here pull alongside get this kind of teed up there we go and we'll hit P and then I think there's a mini game. And if, if again, if I read right, uh, it's like a WASD, like it'll prompt you and you have to hit a button. So let's, let's get started. Uh, D, A, S, A, okay. I see what we're doing here. A, W, A. Okay, so it's a little button pushing here. Fish rolling in. All right, I gotta say these out loud, otherwise I won't see. S A W W. Okay, it's kind of hard. <laughs> I don't know if there's like a the best time to hit it, or as long as you just hit it. I guess if you don't do it right, your net... Oh, every time you hit it wrong, your net gets damaged. Okay, I see what's happening. If you hit, if you hit it, if you hit the wrong key, it damages your net. Okay. And we don't want to damage our net. Although in the grand scheme of things, the nets aren't that expensive. I think they're only like six grand. They're really not that expensive. Keep rolling in the fishes. There's our catch. The holy cow! Four thousand six hundred seventy-two kilograms of cod. To oh my gosh, that's a lot of fish. That is a lot of. I mean, that was half of. That's half our hold. So yes, I really don't want to put more than two nets down. Although I may want to create like a circuit, a circuit of nets. Is what we're what we can do. Let's get this other net in. We're going to get this other net in, and then I'm going to put this guy on gutting, because I think, I think I can get him to gut, too. Uh, repair resting. Is there not a gutting station? 
I thought there was a gutting station. There is. Maybe I have to do it. I thought I could manually assign him to gut. Eventually you can get a mechanical gutter. And you can assign a person to like. Sit there and gut the fish for you. <laughs> this is kind of cool though. Right? It's different. It is different. So far I really like the crab fishing the best. It's my favorite. This is okay. This is this is okay, and it, you can bring in lots of fish really quick. I mean, a lot, a lot of fish really quick. But it's 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 okay. I'd have to say I prefer um, I prefer crab fishing first, and then the long line. I actually like the long line where you swing the hook thing. That's kind of fun. And then net fishing would probably be my third. But at least we're not all alone. At least we have like a buddy. Somebody help us now. Okay. Seas are a little choppy today. Just a little. Get in there. And yeah, let's do this again. Would you like to haul in the net? Yes, I would. Thank you. I would love to haul in the net. Let's try not to damage our net at all. Mm -hmm. Out here on our fishing boat. Hurrah. Hurrah. I need to come up with a couple sea shanties I can sing by at work. For all you viewers at home, I mean, this is... Might as, might as well have the joys of music. Look at that big red fish. And I'm assuming based upon how good they are at their job, maybe your yields increase? I, I would assume. Although, with our little boat, I don't know. I mean, two nets at a time, that's about all we can do. We can set up a good little circuit, though, because we can carry eight 165-meter nets... So if we space them out like maybe three or four hours apart, then we can just kind of drive around, pick up fish, take it back, sell it, all that good stuff. Holy cow, I ran out of storage space. <laughs> wow. 18,000 kilograms of fresh fish. That's kind of ridiculous. All right, you can come off the nets now. Go rest. There's food in the galley. And he goes back in somewhere. He goes to the door that cannot... He goes back into the... To the into the deck. I wish you could go down into the... Um, but you can't. This door won't open. Oh, there's a... Fit. There's one of them in real life. That's a cool picture. I didn't see it. Now, I wonder... Can I not assign him to this... Set gear. Need another. Okay, I need another crew member. Where do I? I guess I. Where do I get the fish? That's my question. Cause I thought. I, mean, I can put them on repairs. But we really don't need anything repaired right now. And I think the more you use them, the better his. Uh, better his skills are. Let's go to gut fish. No, nope, it won't let me assign him to it. So we have to do this ourselves. Four stars! Boat's rocking. See? And that actually does it. Four stars. This is, oh, I just cut my thumb off. No! <laughs> I cut my thumb off again. That's really bad thumb placement. Uh, it is just bad thumb placement. That one's not. That's still four stars. Oh, and this one improves the quality of your fish. Or I guess your sale price of your fish. <laughs> Again, right through the thumb. Ooh, that's the best one yet. Man, this is going to take forever. A lot of fish. 18,000 kilograms of fish. And what is that, like 40,000 pounds? Holy buckets. 
Holy fish guts. See, you know, I'm a waste not, want not kind of guy. So like me, I'm like, man, I wish I had some crab pots because I put all these fish guts in the crab pots and then drop those overboard. Let, let those get, you know, let those get uh, crab in them. Come back and pick them up because you, you don't, I don't want to waste stuff. Man, it's going to take forever. Start. Oh, that's not a good one. I missed the line. Yep, you got to be right on the dotted line. And I think the faster you go, the better it gets. Yeah. So, like, if you if you the, the faster you can do it on a straight line, the higher it is. Okay. So seventeen thousand. I got tons, tons of, of uh, good fish in there. All right, so what I'm going to do is, before I head back in, because it's a waste of time, I'm going to go ahead and set a couple more nets and uh, head back into town and sell our catch. Let's see how much money we made on this run. Of, uh, we have 1,600 kilograms free, but we're done. We're, our hold's kind of full. And look at, I don't know if you've noticed... But the boat is sitting real low in the water. Because <laughs> it's heavy. Look how, look how low. Look how low to the water it's sitting. <laughs> yeah, rough seas aren't fun when you're this close to the water. Look at this. This is pretty cool. And I'm pretty sure that you... Let's see if water will splash up on deck. Yeah. Whoa. Oh, 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 oh. oh man. I don't know if I want to set nets in this. No, we're, we're just going to head back in. Okay. Seas are a little rough for setting nets. Definitely a little rough for setting nets. Ooh. I'm a little nervous right now. I'm a, I mean, ooh, that much weight. You could sink this bad boy real easy, I bet. If you're not careful, we're facing the completely wrong direction. All right, we're going to get back into dock and uh, sell our, our catch, see how much money we make. Here comes another big wave. Hopefully, hopefully we don't die. We'll, we'll say a prayer to the fishing gods. See you, see you back at port. All right, let's head head into uh, port here and see see what we, uh, see what our catch is. But yeah, it, I've, I have noticed that the more weight you have, the, your boat will actually start sinking in, which I, thought, I think is a pretty cool feature. It's kind of neat. And you're, you're really sluggish. That's why it's recommended you do horsepower upgrades as you upgrade your storage space. Because that way, I mean, you're you're not going to move as fast, but it helps helps maneuvering and such. Okay, I'm really excited to see what we got. This is a lot of fish. I still don't think it's going to be tons of money though. Not like catching crab. So hit sell. Three hundred thirty-eight thousand eight hundred seventy-three dollars and ninety-four uh, cents. Yeah, man, that's a lot of cod. Cod, haddock, pollock, redfish. Very nice. That's uh, I'm actually curious to see uh, see what we have on our. Oh yeah, we we're not anywhere near our quotas. Look at this, man. We can fish for days. We can fish forever. Oh, what's going on in town here at the bar? Load cod supply and forcel. I'm going to have to start doing some of these to increase my reputations. Because I think the higher your reputation, the better prices you get. But then again, it's not like the economy is not broken. This game, the economy is kind of broken. Uh, although, it, I guess it's a game. It's supposed to be fun. It's not to be too grindy. But I'm, I already have a million, Krona. million. And then one of our nets is damaged. Okay, so you can repair a net for 2000 or buy a new one. So we'll just repair our net. No problem there. Uh, let's see, are there any new crew people? This guy has really good net hauling. Machine gutting, hand gutting, long line. He's a good fisherman. He's not a good crabber. The guy I have has an overall rating of 98. 
That's why I took him, because his, his scores on everything are just a little higher. But this guy's really good at net hauling. But we'll go with the guy we have on board. Einhard Haraldson. He's He can repair a boat in a pinch. If we're going to sink, we want a guy that can fix stuff, right? That's what we want. All right. I think that's it, guys. Thank you so much for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed this episode. This is net fishing. Uh, what's next? Let's see what's next. Uh, we can get into... This is the same. This is just net fishing and... Oh, look at this little boat. It's kind of cool looking. Um... But it's just at a larger scale. Plus, we can hire more crew. So, eventually we get it. These are locked. This is crab pot fishing. And this, eventually, this, I think this is going to be our next. Our, we're going to work towards this. To do the large, large rectangular pot fishing. Because this is just long line and net. Which is exactly what we did, just on a bigger scale. Because we have a crew and all that. I mean, eventually, I think we'll get these. Because I'd like to do each one of these big boats. These are because they're really cool looking and they have cranes and all different kinds of stuff. Uh, what's this? Cause this really isn't very different than what we're already doing. It's just a different kind of boat. Yeah. Yeah, so the next step is going to be... What do you think? I don't know. OBD. What is this one? Long line nets crew of five. It's kind of a cool boat, though. I like that one. Eventually, I want to get into these, but they're locked right now because we have we don't have enough time in the, the smaller boat. But these are the big trawlers with the big like trawling nets. They're pretty cool. Oh, speaking of, you know what we need to do? You know what we need to do? I asked for a name last time. And we need to uh, need to change the name of the selfie two. Are you ready for it? Melted Butter. <laughs> ah, that's what we're going with. We're going to name it the Melted Butter because we like to crab fish. So this is the Melted Butter. Uh, thank you, Farmer Klein, for the suggestion. It was a great suggestion. Let's see. Um, what color do we want it? Yellow? With yellow? Sure, let's go with yellow. And that is all for this episode, guys. Thank you so much for refuel it at, at 4,000 krona. Thank you for tuning in. I do appreciate it. I hope you guys have a wonderful, wonderful weekend. And we'll see you next time on the Barrett Sea. Take care. Stay safe, everybody. See you later. Bye.